Siu Mai is often the first item I will order whenever I'm at the dim sum restaurant. Siu Mai is a squat cylinder dumpling, typically filled with pork and shrimps. I have developed a healthier version for siu mai for two main reasons. First, usually pork fat bag are used at the restaurant because it will give the dumpling a juicy and favorable texture. Unfortunately, pork fat bag is not good for health and it is really fatty. So, I'm replacing it with pork shoulder instead. Secondly, the restaurant often use baking soda water to soak the shrimps to ensure more plums when cooked. I personally feel that it is not necessary as long as the shrimps is fresh and you can skip the baking soda method if possible. This tutorial consists of three parts. First, the preparation and the ingredient. Second, the fillings and how to season them. Third, how to cup and steam the siu mai. And here are the ingredients you need. Briefly cut the pork shoulder into large cubes or strips. Shelf and devein the shrimps. If you do not have dried shiitake mushroom, you can also use fresh mushrooms. For seasoning, sesame seed oil, corn flour, salt and white pepper. For convenience, I'm using the ready wonton pastry wrappers, a few green peas for garnish, and some fish rum for extra flavors. The authentic style recipe called for dried shiitake mushroom, but I find that the fresh one work as well. Means the meat first before the shrimps because the meat is more tougher. I personally prefer the meat chopped costly, but if you prefer it to be more fine, by all means do that. Add the chopped meat into the mushroom and season it with a bit of sesame oil. Next, add the corn flour, salt, pepper and egg white. Once they are mixed well, keep them in the refrigerator for at least 30 minutes or overnight before use. For garnish, I divided the shrimps into half, set aside. If your wonton pastry skins are frozen, make sure you defrost it 1 to 2 hours before use. Did you notice that one side of the wonton skin is more flat than the others? This is to ensure that the filling will not slip off the wrappers. Take a spoonful of the filling and place it in the center of the wrapper. To create the squat cylinder, use your finger to create a ring so that it forms a cup for the fillings to settle. Squeeze the filling gently to form a cup. Use the back of the spoon to even the surface of the fillings. For an appetizing finishing touch, I like to add a shrimps and two peas to decorate it. If you are planning to use crab roll or fish roll, add those at the end, after the siu mai are cooked and out of the steamer. Arrange the siu mai in bamboo steamer, leaving room around each siu mai. Steam in batches if necessary. My favorite tea for steamed dumpling is green tea because it contains antioxidant, it helps digestion and it is mild and very refreshing. When the siu mai is still a little warm, add the fish roll on top of each siu mai. Siu mai can be frozen if you plan to make party food in advance. Usually, no dipping sauce is required, but if you like it to be a little bit spicy, a diesel of shiracha sauce will satisfy those craving for spicy taste. 